Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So, uh, as you know, yesterday I reacted to a video of Alan Walker, a music video song. Uh, he dedicated that song to support a Royal Challengers Bangalore cricket team in Indian Premier League. So, uh, I found a video that dedicated to like behind the scenes of that song, how he was creating it, how he was meeting players and everything. So, I think it's always interesting to see like how people are creating the songs and behind the scenes of it. So let's see. 3,000 people and they are all cheering for their favorite so cricket team, RCB. We are about to go on the pitch and surprise them with a brand new song that I have made so for the team. So fans didn't know about this song so let's before. See. Is it good enough to become a worthy member of the RCB family? I have always been a huge fan of sports. But for some reason, I didn't turn out to become a professional athlete. But that's okay, I just tell myself I chose music. Anyway, it all started when I was planning my next India tour. Psst, these are the cities. And I am giving out some free tickets. Stick around to see how you can get one. And when I was researching cities, I kind of got lost in Bengaluru. Because this team kept popping up everywhere. RCB! RCB, this massive cricket team. Incredibly passionate fan base. Legendary players with gigantic followings. I mean, I knew cricket was big, but yeah, what? I also didn't know Everything about how this. huge like drew me in cricket instantly. is, like how it's popular in India. This. They have freaking team songs, and this is apparently a big thing across many Indian cricket teams. So, as you can imagine, I could not help myself. And then I waited. Oh. Actually, not for very long. He they wanted responded to make pretty it. damn quickly. It was game on, but only if I play it live at their stadium. <laughs> We have a deal. Fast forward a week in the studio and a long flight. We are in India and if you're wondering about a bat, it's a cricket bat. There's 33,000 people coming to the stadium today and I'm going to play the song live for them. It's always fun to come to India and the streets are always full of energy. I even I like met my friend Guru Rantawa at the hotel and I just had to ask. What's the thing about India and the cricket, like the hype around it and... The... I think the thing about India and cricket is like uh, the thing about Alan and music. Same way. Yeah. Yeah. So the way where you are with your music, I think India, they, they love cricket that much and then they're born with it. Uh, and everybody grows up with watching cricket and playing cricket every corner of India. Mm. and. Uh, I, I think basically we all are cricket only. So cricket yeah, unites in the end, I guess. Everybody in India plays cricket. Yeah, yeah. yeah well, are you good? I'm, I'm, I'm one of the greatest players of all time. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, right. So it's clear that cricket means a lot in India. That made me a bit nervous. Let's make of our way over to the stadium. And I could feel the pressure starting to come over me. We've been working on this song for quite a while. I've never played a song before. And I really hope the team likes it, but maybe more importantly, the fans. RCB calls them the 12th man army. The fans are just as much as part of the journey as the players, and that's exactly how it's supposed to be. And as I'm pulling up to the stadium, I can already hear the fans roaring. Yeah. Wow, that's massive, and you can even hear the crowd. And after She's donning nervous. a quick energy drink, oh. hey. I felt like I needed to get more okay, into the whole the cricket jokes. mindset. I've only played cricket once before. Didn't go very well, but we have hope, I have faith, and I believe that one day I'll be the world's best cricketer. He's full of jokes. Whoa! Mm, not, not, not bad. I'm actually hitting. This time, I actually managed to hit the ball. Mm. Okay. Maybe not every time. And I even got some spectators. But now it was time to enter the stadium and meet the team. And as we stepped out on the stands, I was blown away. So many people. Crazy atmosphere. The atmosphere and energy was insane. It was true what everyone said about the RCB fans. They're amazing. I can't believe that RCB is letting me do this. The atmosphere out there is incredible. But before my show, there is one more and quite an essential group we need to say hi to. Hi. The players. Hi, I'm Alan. Congratulations on winning. It's amazing. The women's team had actually just won the Premier League wow. and they did it only two years after the team was established. Happy for you, for I you didn't guys. even know really about cool. women's team. And then I got to meet the men's team. Hi, I'm Alan. Hello, Alan. Have you guys heard the track? Yeah, do you like it? <laughs> I'm really excited to show the people the song, and I uh, think it's going to be great. Whoa! Nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you. You just had a daughter? I just had a son. Son? Yeah. Wow, congratulations. Thank you very much. 
He's just meeting all the players and it looks amazing. Amazing. Pleasure. As the sun sets in Bengaluru, it's finally time. Oh, even I feel nervous now. How fans feel like it? It's in moments like these I come hmm. to think about how lucky I am to be doing what I do. And hearing the crowd cheering me onto stage made me incredibly happy. A platinum record holder, none other than the biggest music creator of the world, Alice Walker! In front of those 30, it was RCB all real during never, the game. Forget. I couldn't have asked for a better reaction from the 12th man army. It was incredible. Wow, what a thank you. Please make some noise for yourselves. Seeing RCB bring people together and treat fans like family reminds me so much of our own Walker community. Right when I got here, I felt like I was part of the family. And for all of you Indians, this fall of 2024, I am coming back. It's going to be 10 shows, and I have hidden secret codes inside the music video for the RCB team song with free tickets. So, if you want to win free tickets to my India tour, yeah, go yeah, I think you can know it yourself. So thank you guys a lot for watching first of all and uh, it was interesting to see behind the scenes and how he was meeting players and uh, how he didn't even like plan to create the song. He just, this idea came to his mind. He was like, yeah, let's text uh, the team. Yeah, why not? So, and they agreed and it was crazy. So um, yeah, and it was interesting how he mentioned that he wanted to become a sportsman himself, but didn't. And uh, then he just created the song for like cricket team, huge cricket team uh, for like the whole fan base. It's crazy how life can change. Okay, over time, okay. Uh, and he so nicely described India at first, like the, um, at the beginning of this video, like how he traveled to India and how it was nice and the energy on the streets. And also, yeah, it was fun how he was meeting all of the cricket players and I think many of you would love to meet them in person. And I, I don't know, I think it's just dream of people in general to meet their like, uh, to meet people who they support, who like inspire them, so yeah, it was a pretty inspiring video and it's nice how some decisions can just change your life, you can just say okay why not text in your favorite team and say like uh, let's, let's make a song for you and they just agreed, it's crazy, I thought like the team invited him to create a song but what? <laughs> okay, uh, thank you guys for watching this video. Tell me in the comments how did you like all this behind the scenes, uh, how the song was created, and yeah, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, and see you in the next videos. Bye bye.